I'd like to ask, uh, first of all, um, the Central Bank of Nigeria uh, published some data this week that showed that in November 2019, um, the federal government ran a budget deficit of about 4.6 trillion naira. So initially, the budget um, uh, for the revenue estimates in the budget was 7 trillion, but at the end of the day, it could only raise about 4 trillion. So, in my mind, I'm asking uh, the, the Finance Act. How much of a game changer can it really be for the government in terms of revenue generation? Because there's a big gap in there. What well, the the Finance Act is going to help us expand the tax base, because by some of the provisions that we made uh, that are favourable to small and medium enterprises, means that we're going to be able to encourage more of those businesses to move out of the informal sector to the formal sector. The Nigerian economy is largely 60% is from the formal sector. So those are uh, people running businesses into which government is not collecting any taxes. Also, the fact that we re uh, reduced, uh, we made it easy for them to come on into the tax net and also we reduced taxes and also in some cases even zero taxes just to encourage them to become formal. By becoming formal, not only is it that they can pay taxes, but they can access financing from the banking system and several other support that government can give to them when they are registered and known and they have um, an address and we know the kind of businesses they are, they are involved in. So the Finance Act is meant to, the major achievement for us in the Finance Act is, is targeted at improving business. Mm. And also, but so not really about revenue generation. It is also about.